Saka gives alms to Venerable Kasapa, arising from Naroda Samapati, temporary suspension of mental activities. Venerable Kasapa entered into an area where poor people were dwelling in the city of Rajagaha for almshood. His intention was to give a poor man an opportunity of gaining great merit as a result of offering alms food to one who had just come out of Niroda Samapati. Saka, king of the Devas, wishing to take the opportunity of offering alms food to Kasapa, assumed the form of a poor old weaver and came to Rajagaha with his wife Sujata. Kasapa stood at the door the poor old weaver took the bowl from Kasapa and filled up the bowl with rice and curry. The delicious smell of the curry spread everywhere. Then it occurred to Kasapa that this person was un- not an ordinary human being, and he came to realize that this was Saka himself. Saka admitted the fact and claimed that he too was poor because he had had no opportunity of offering anything to anyone during the time of the Buddha. So saying, Saka and his wife Sujata left Kasapa after paying their respects. From his monastery, the Buddha saw Saka and Sujata leaving and told the bhikkhus about Saka offering amsut to Kasapa. The bhikkhus wondered how Saka knew that Kasapa had just come out of Niroda Sumapati and that it was the right and auspicious time for him to make an offering to Kasapa. The question was put up to the Buddha who answered, Bhikkhus, the reputation of a virtuous one like my son Kasapa spreads far and wide, it reaches even the Deva world. On account of his good reputation, Saka himself has come to pay his respects.